Hey guys, today's tutorial is over Kraken and getting you started with cryptocurrency trading. This is the initial login screen after you've signed up with your email address. And in order to begin trading, you, we are going to need to get verified to tier one verification. And in order to do that, we're going to need to click on the uh, ver get verified button right there. And the uh, level of verification that you're going to want to get uh, eventually is really going to depend on how active you plan on being uh, with trading. But for now, we're just going to go over the tier one. We need to put our full name, date of birth, country, phone number. And once we do that, we are going to be able to deposit cryptocurrency. So if you have purchased uh, some some Bitcoin or some Ethereum off of Coinbase or uh, you know you had a buddy give it to you you can now once you verify this information you can begin to de deposit cryptocurrency and you can trade um, you cannot yet deposit cash you can't put money in from your bank account yet until you get verified to tier 2 uh, but for this for this video we're just gonna go tier 1 verification so once we verify our information by filling this out fill this out get verified um, after we've done that then we will again be able to deposit cryptocurrency um, such as Bitcoin or Ethereum and once we have gotten verified we will go over to funding fundings right here Okay, now that we have been verified for the tier one, we verified ourselves for tier one, we can now go over here to the left and deposit some cryptocurrency. Again, tier one does not allow us to deposit USD or any of these uh, you know, centralized currencies, this country currencies. We can only do cryptocurrencies. So uh, most of you probably have started with Bitcoin or Ethereum. Um, we can click over here and this will bring us to our uh, deposit address, uh, the address to which we will send our money from our other wallet um, to get it onto Kraken so we can begin trading. So let's click here on the Bitcoin deposit and we've got this information over here and down here at the bottom we're going to have a uh, deposit address. This deposit address is what is going to um, be our receiving address for our Kraken account. So we can send, use this address right here and use that to send our Bitcoin to that address. This is our deposit address. Also, if you'd like, you can click over here on QR code and this brings up this QR code. So if you're using your phone, you can actually just scan that, uh, that QR code and send it to that, that address right there. Um, so again, the, one of these addresses, you can generate new addresses. Uh, it makes you safer. Um, but this is the address. This is where you would be sending. This is your own address at Kraken. So send your money here. Um, and you can use the QR code here to send your, your first Bitcoins to get them onto Kraken to begin trading for other cryptocurrencies or to begin trading for uh, USD to buy and sell very quickly. So let's say we want to... So let's say that we want to instead of going between Ethereum and Bitcoin or Ethereum and USD, we just want to go Bitcoin to USD. We want to sell uh, some of our Bitcoin that we had deposited earlier. So if we wanted to sell new order, so trade new order, intermediate, you can go simple, but um, I think intermediate's good. So let's go Bitcoin to USD and we're gonna go sell. We wanna sell it, red means sell. So let's say we deposited one full Bitcoin. So if I were to sell it to the highest bidder right now on Kraken, it would sell for $902 in USD. 
So this would give me uh, USD into my Kraken account if I wanted to begin to try to buy the other cryptocurrencies. If I didn't want to go through the currency pairs like trading Bitcoin for Ethereum because that can get a little confusing for some people. Um, we just want to get good old USD. So we can sell, you know, or half our Bitcoin if we deposited a full Bitcoin. We want to deposit half a Bitcoin and we're selling for the market, whatever the highest bid is right now. And we're going to get $451. Uh, again, let's say um, we see that the high for today was $920 for a Bitcoin and the low was $830 for a Bitcoin. And I'm hoping that the price is going to go up. It, see, we have the high for 920. We're currently at 902. But let's say I, I don't think it's worth it to sell my Bitcoin unless we make some money. Let's say up at uh, $950. So we can go, instead of market, we can click on limit. And we're going to sell it at $950 per Bitcoin. So if we sold half our Bitcoin at a limit of $950, we will receive $475 for the half of the Bitcoin that we had sold. So it will just wait. So if I click on this sell, if I click on the sell for USD, then it will wait until the value or until somebody is willing to pay $950 per Bitcoin before we sell that half. So it will just sit there. Um, under orders, you can check and see um, if your order has been filled yet or not. So again, trade, new order, intermediate, and we're going to sell. We can click buy or sell. We're going to sell 0.5 Bitcoin, so half a Bitcoin, for at when it reaches $950 per Bitcoin. So we're waiting until it gets um, higher than it currently is. So it's saying right now the last trade was for 905. We're not going to do our trade until it hits $950 per Bitcoin. Limit $470, $475 per Bitcoin. This is $475 what we would receive for half of our Bitcoin. We can click sell for USD. And that will initiate that. Um, this over here, this leverage, you you won't be able to get access to that um, until you have you know verified higher levels. Um, but for now, we can just completely ignore this. This is um, the set standard is all perfectly fine. We leave that alone. Uh, we just pay attention to this until we get a little bit more advanced, and we can start tinkering with that. Thanks for watching. Uh, be sure to check back for the next video. I'll go over a little bit more advanced stuff in Kraken. And I might potentially do some videos on some of the other exchanges to give them a little bit of love too. Uh, let me know if you guys have any other questions, specific uh, things you want to know about, and I can try to get that done in the next video. Uh, be sure to like, subscribe, share. Let me know what your, uh, your thoughts are on the video and uh, any other potential ways I can help you guys out. Let me know. Thanks. Bye.